welcome back to my channel um in today's video i'm gonna be doing a little get ready with me for a job interview i did this video last week because i had another job interview um but i don't think that's gonna work out it's not like it went bad or anything but my heart is not leading me in that direction so yeah but today i'm gonna be doing a little get ready with me for this job interview that is actually on zoom so it's a little bit more less stressful because I don't have to go nowhere. But yeah, I just wanted to do a little video and show you guys and talk to you guys about life. Because in my video, I think it's like two videos down, I talked about, you know, life after graduation, feeling a little bit of discouragement, but I'm trying not to let that get to me because I have to remain um positive and having faith in god it's truly after i posted that video about me feeling you know a little nervous about life after graduation i got two job interviews right after that video and i was so grateful i was so thankful that was god talking to me because honestly god is here he's always here and it's like you should always remain positive you should always pray up and have your faith lead it towards God because God works wonders and he really showed out for me. Actually, after that video of me talking about me doing it on my own, trying to get this job stuff, it's, just, it's been falling into my hands like no other. Like two job interviews right after that video it was kind of insane, but God was talking to me and he definitely gave me a lot of answers that I need. Oh, my lace is lifting, but I don't care. <laughs> But yeah, y'all, so I'm just really, really excited for what God has in store for me. Um, this is why you should always remain positive, remain um, having faith in God, and pray. Like, just, like, prayers work. Like, I don't understand why people don't think prayers work. It, it works. It works. Trust me. Because right after those videos, well, that video that I posted, I was praying to God, like, a lot, a lot, a lot, like, more than just once a day. And now i'm getting ready for a job interview and even if i don't get this job it's through the fact that the interview came right after i prayed for it so it's just like even if it doesn't work out i'm gonna still be very very positive i'm still remain having faith in god because i know what he has in store for me is all that i can ask for okay i'm back i don't know what i was saying but yeah i'm gonna just remain and have faith in god because literally god never fails he never misses a beat so i'm just really really thankful and grateful for everything that he has in store for me like i said even if i don't get these job interviews i'm still very grateful that i even got to a job interview like i even got the chance to talk to somebody because regardless of where i'm directed into or the direction that god wants me headed in i know it's the right direction for me so if this job doesn't work out I'm going to still just keep on looking for jobs and pray up to God because I know God is just leading me in the place that I need to be in. Regardless of what I think, regardless if I'm scared or not, regardless if I'm like discouraged a little bit, because as humans, we do get discouraged. But regardless of all of that, I'm going to still remain positive and have my faith all in God because he works wonders. But yeah, I'm not going to flat iron my hair. I don't know if I should. I, okay, I, I guess I am. I guess I am. So I forgot to mention that this job that I'm applying for or that I'm getting an interview for is for a teacher assistant position because I just graduated with my um, degree in early childhood education. So I do want to work with kids and <clears throat> I do want to be a, a assistant teacher. I don't want to be a teacher just yet because I am going back to school for my pediatric speech pathologist degree. I can't wait to go back to school so I can just get it over with. Like, I've been in school for a long time. Um, I just graduated with my associates and I am taking a little break. So I'm taking like a semester off. So I am going to apply for more schools, not more schools, but like two um, this week and see what schools offer the best programs for speech pathology and then I'm gonna apply and start the school stuff again because i'm going back but after that then i'm done with school i just want to pursue my dream career in speech pathology they might have me go back for a master's but i don't know about all of that 
I don't know honestly if I want to go do that I don't yeah even if I do get my master's it would not be anytime soon and I'm just being honest I'm kind of like done with school that's why I need I needed this break from associates to a bachelor's I just needed to breathe you know but um if I do have to get my master's to go into the field that I want to go into then I'll just do it but right now I don't see myself doing that like a master's degree program because I just I don't know I, I'm kind of like over it with school <laughs> All right, you guys, so I'm done with the hair. I'm not gonna do too much because I'm on Zoom, so I don't really have to go too overboard with trying to, you know, get my lace together. I am going back outside, but it's just to the store. That's mainly it. It is lifting because I sweat too much. Like, I sweat a lot, but it's fine, it's fine, you know? So this is the shirt I'm gonna wear. Um, I don't usually wear blue shirts, like, to interviews or anything like that. I usually wear, like, white or like a beige kind of color but it's mostly white that, that I wear but it's an online interview so I don't think it'll be that much of a problem um you know my preference is white for like shirts for job interviews but you know I, I don't think it will hurt I don't think it will hurt but yeah let me see how I feel about this shirt Mm, no, it's whatever. Let's just put this on and call it a day. <laughs> Cause like, honestly, it is what it is. Okay, so I got this shirt on. I will button it up more when I get on Zoom. I'm just so hot. Um, I'm really, really hot. I get like, I get hot easily. I sweat easily. I don't know if that's a big problem, but like I sweat severely bad. I was gonna do makeup. This is my makeup little kit thingy and i do need more makeup i don't have much but that's that right there i was gonna do makeup but mm, i might just slap on some lip gloss and call it a day because like i do have my eyebrows on but i'm gonna just be in the house you know i don't know what time is it 11 45 i got like approximately seven more minutes because i want to be on there early but yeah that's basically it let me put on some lip gloss okay so that's it for the little get ready with me like i said it's on zoom so it's nothing too too much that i have to do my interview last week i was going to do a get ready with me but because it was outside like a in-person um interview I was just moving around too much. I couldn't really film like I wanted to, but that's that. Thank you guys for watching. Like I said, uh, remain positive. Have faith in God because God works wonders. Wherever he wants you to lead it in, he would definitely guide you in that direction. And that's what something I have to work on as well is having more faith in God than I have right now. Because although I do have faith, I know that I do have a little bit of fears and fear and faith do not correspond. So if you have a little bit of fear, like just try to control it at a minimum because it, as humans, we do have that emotion of fear, but don't let it control you. Don't let it step over the boundaries that you have with God. So yeah, that's something I have to work on as well because when I worry, I worry. Like, And I just have to remember like, God, remember God. Like, Don't forget God. God is right there. He, he knows your life story and it's in his hands. So just let him guide you and everything will fall into place. So, yes, I'm about to get on my Zoom interview because it's in 10 minutes and I want to be there five minutes early. So, yeah, um, I am going to record a little bit of how it goes and tell you guys how my interview goes. So, this is not the final ending of the video, but if it is by chance, 
because I know with me I can lack on my filming <laughs> um, content you know but yeah like if this is the end of the video thank you guys for watching get a thumbs up comment down below and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next one but if this is not the ending just continue to watch the video and I'll see you in the next one. this is what it's like living in New York City when I try to film it's always some type of noise even when the window is closed but yeah like I was saying I'm about to jump on my zoom and get the show on a road <laughs>